Many times, a screenshot is not enough to demonstrate your point. If this is the case, you can record a video to make your point clear. In this lesson, I will demonstrate how to use Snagit to record your computer screen and make some quick video edits. I will do this by demonstrating how to cite and reference a resource using Microsoft Word. Open the Word document that you want to use. Open Snagit. To create a video, click on the Video tab. You will be presented with several options that will allow you to customize your capture. For example, you can choose to record your webcam, system audio, microphone, or capture your cursor. When you are ready to record your video, click on the big red capture button. You will see yellow crosshairs appear on your screen. Hold down your mouse button, move the crosshairs to select the area of the computer screen that you want to record. Release the mouse button. A recording toolbar will appear at the bottom of your selection with some options. A red button to start your recording. You have the option to record your video using your system audio or your microphone. Note. If you have multiple audio inputs, you will see a drop-down menu to choose your microphone. Before you record, you will be able to adjust your screen size. You can choose to capture the selected area that you have defined. You can redo or start a new video or cancel your video. When you are happy with your settings, click on the record button. You will observe a countdown screen. 3 2 1 You are now recording your screen. During the recording, Snagit captures everything that happens in the selected area of your screen. Once the recording starts, you will be presented with some options. A blue button to stop your recording. A pause button to pause your video. Once the pause button is clicked, this button will turn red. When you are ready to restart your recording, click on the red button, your recording will resume. You can turn on or off your system audio or microphone. You can note the record time of the video. You can redo your video, minimize the record menu to the taskbar, or cancel your video. When you have finished recording your video, click on the stop button. Now that you understand the basics, I will demonstrate capturing a video. Note that when capturing a video, you will not be able to use annotations during recording. On the toolbar, click on the References menu. Click on Manage Sources. Select the correct resource from the left menu, Master List. Click on Copy, the selected resource will be moved to the current list in the right menu. Click on Close. Position your cursor where you want to place the citation. Click on the References menu again and now select from the menu, Insert Citation. You will notice a drop-down menu where you will observe the citation copy to the current list. Click on your citation, and it will be pasted in the area of your document where you positioned your cursor. Position your cursor where you want to insert your bibliography. Click on the References menu again. Select the menu Bibliography. You will observe several options. For this demonstration, I will choose References. You will note that the bibliography will be pasted in the area of your document where you positioned your cursor. When you have finished recording your video, click on the stop button. The video will open in the Snagit editor. Use the video controls to preview the recording. If you find a section that you want to edit, drag the green or red handles to select the area you want to remove. Click on cut to remove the highlighted section. You will note that a yellow line marks where the video was edited. Once you are happy with your edits, save the video to your computer or use the share menu to send it to popular sharing destinations. Sharing your content will be covered in a later video. In the next lesson, I will demonstrate how to create a video from images.